a special halacha that is connected to saying Shmona Esrei is the direction in which the petitioner should stand. So we know that if you live, if you're davening in Eretz Yisrael, then you face Yerushalayim. And if you're in Yerushalayim, you face the Beit HaMikdash, even today when the Beit HaMikdash has been destroyed. Outside of Eretz Yisrael, you face in the direction of Eretz Yisrael. And then every, wherever he happens to be davening, he has to kind of think that he is in the holy place, in the Beit HaMikdash, and, uh, and that's uh, the reason that most shuls in, uh, say, America are built east-west, so that if you put the uh, Aron Kodesh on the eastern side of the shul, everybody is always facing in the general direction of Yerushalayim, right? Whereas in Russia, you would build the shuls north-south and uh, put the, the Aron Kodesh on the south. And that way people in Russia, when they daven, would be facing Yerushalayim. In Eretz Yisrael, I mean, the closer you get to Yerushalayim, the more difficult it becomes. Because you can't always build the shul exactly facing the Beit HaMikdash. I mean, you may know where the Beit HaMikdash is, but the plot of land may just not allow it, may not allow it to happen. So, uh, very often you go into a shul in, in Yerushalayim, and the people are makpid, they're careful to daven in the direction of Yerushalayim, which might not be the direction of the Aron Kodesh. Right? It might not be the direction of the Aron Kodesh exactly. In fact, I know that in one of the neighborhoods in Yerushalayim, somebody went so far as to uh, figure out from each chair in the shul how the direction to the Beit HaMikdash would vary from one seat to another. And he, he enabled all of the, by putting, uh, putting this on a piece of paper, you stood on the paper, and you were able to uh, direct yourselves exactly to the Beit HaMikdash. I'm not sure that that's the pshat in the halacha. I think the pshat in the halacha is that we should think of ourselves as being in the Beit HaMikdash and davening in the Beit HaMikdash and, and facing even approximately in the direction of the Beit HaMikdash should be sufficient to enable that to enable that to happen. And there is no really... Uh, I, the, this idea that you could be perfectly precise, I think, is probably overdoing the matter.